While we were staging, I realized that the kitchen window was looking a little bare. So in an effort to give it a little bit of more, a little something, we're gonna use some of our leftover materials to make a Roman shade. So basically this is just a cardboard box and the curtains that we cut from the bottom. We've already measured the inside of the kitchen window. We didn't have glue sticks, so we're gonna spray this bad boy outside because you need to be not inside doing that. And basically we're going to layer these leftover pieces of fabric like so. Let's see what happens. So basically I'm just gonna spray this top and lay my first piece of fabric. We'll measure it, cut it later. Come on girl. my window so then I'm gonna go around this way and we're gonna basically put this side of the cardboard inside the window let's see if I can cut straight line I want to say you have to have really strong forearms. Might hurt right now. Okay. Keep going. It's all for the pretty. All for the sake of the pretty. All right. I know you guys don't want to see me cut this, so I'm going to cut it and then we'll go over to the window. So basically, we're just going to take the other part of the cardboard. There were some brackets already in the window, so basically, we're just going to use that and hopefully slide this bad boy in there because the other one did. Ooh, look at that, perfection. So we slid that into place. You just hide all of your, tuck in your imperfections to show that it's not a cardboard. It is, it's a cardboard. We're gonna tuck that in. It's actually very secure. My plan was to take like this little tack. This is what the makeup girls do. They do that, can you see the tack? And Secure it underneath here, and I'm just gonna use my thumb because it's a thumb tag. Mm. Just to give it a little more security so it doesn't sag over time. Weather, humidity, whatever. And look at that. Look at that. We have ourselves 
a little chroma shade for the kitchen window. Isn't that cute? So cute. 